In the 17th century, Hans Christian Orsted found that an electrical current in a wire produces a magnetic field. This discovery led to many innovations in the technological world, including the invention of electromagnets and the first electric motor. This led Michael Faraday, a young physicist, to find that moving a magnet relative to a loop or turn of wire induced an electrical current, and that moving the loop relative to the magnet also created a current. Essentially, Faraday's experiments proved that we could produce an electrical current with magnets. An example of this can be found in a common household item, a flashlight. But, as you can see, this isn't an average flashlight. This one works without batteries. You simply shake it like this, turn it on, and voila, you have light. Now, let's take a closer look and see what's really going on inside. We are looking at the inner workings of our flashlight. You can see the copper wire coil, the magnet, and the light bulb. As the magnet passes through the coil of copper wire, the magnet's magnetic field cuts the turns of the coil and this induces a current flow in the coil, seen here. When the magnet moves in the other direction, our current is induced again, but this time in the opposite direction.